Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So today's video is going to be my second fall haul and I know it's only the start of August and I've already had two fall hauls but here we are. So I'm really excited because I have two of my favorite things in this fall haul. I have Bath and Body Works stuff and I have Raydun. So if you guys don't know what Raydun is, it's pottery basically that they only sell at Marshalls, TJ Maxx, and Home Goods. And it's very coveted and they just started releasing their fall and Halloween stuff. So I'm gonna show you a little bit of what I found. I didn't find a lot, so don't get too excited, but I did find some cute things. So if you're excited to see the Bath and Body Works and the Raydun stuff that I got for fall, then just keep watching. Okay, so to start it off, I did find a few SAS things. I didn't get too sidetracked by SAS, so that was good, but I found these two Vanilla Bean Noel deep cleansing hand soaps and they were $2, so I couldn't pass it up. Vanilla Bean Noel is one of my favorite, favorite scents of all time. It probably is my favorite. Yeah, it definitely is. Um, and this is also my favorite formula for the soaps, so I could not pass them up for $2. I kind of should have gotten more, but I feel like two is good. I don't need to go crazy. I'm probably gonna wanna buy them again this year anyways. So two is good for $2. So the rest of the stuff basically, okay. I went in because my birthday was on the second and I went in on the first and I was like, just treat yourself, Victoria, get whatever you want. But I got in the store and I was like, don't, don't buy too much though because like minimalism. So I didn't buy too much, but I did get a little bit of stuff. And I decided that I'm gonna go back when they have like everything fully stocked because some of the ranges didn't have like the space the body spray and they only had the body cream or whatever and they didn't have the scrub and I wanted the scrub so I was just like just wait until like August or the beginning of September and go back and get what you really want when they have all of the collections out so that's what I decided to do but for now I kind of held myself over on the fall fall game um, by getting a few things so the first thing I actually really needed was a car fragrance and I already put this on my car. I got the pumpkin cupcake. It smells really, really good. Um, I have a leaves one, but I didn't want to use that just yet. I'm not quite ready for that. So I just wanted like a bakery scent for now for the summer and it smells really good in my car. So very happy I got that. It was $4. I just bought one. I paid $4, like whatever. I just wanted it. So that's really what I did to treat myself for my birthday. I just paid full price for everything, which it's not, the best thing but I just didn't worry about coupons because I did, didn't have any so um, the next thing I got is the marshmallow fireside concentrated room spray I got this for me in my brother's bathroom and this was 850 I just paid full price for it because I only wanted one and they're not gonna sucker me into getting a million when I don't need them all and they only had like a few fall scents out so it just smells really good and I thought that it was kind of a scent that both me and my brother would not mind having in there because I know he wouldn't want like a cupcake but I wouldn't want like a strong cologne. So this was kind of like a middle ground. Um, so this will be our bathroom scent. And then I did get something that I'm really excited about. I got three of the Vanilla Mocha Cafe body care items. So I got the shower gel, I got the body lotion, and I got the fragrance mist. So I'm very happy about this spray right now, actually. Oh, it smells really good. It smells more chocolatey than I would have guessed, but I mean, it's mocha, so that makes sense. Um, so the fragrance notes are cozy cappuccino, vanilla orchid, and white tonka bean. Tonka bean is what drew me in because I love that. And vanilla orchid sounds great too. Cappuccino, I think it just has that like slight mocha to it where it has a little bit of coffee. I mean, a little bit of chocolate but it's not too strong. It smells so good. I really couldn't smell it too much in store, but I knew it would be something that I loved. So I went ahead and got it. It's not like necessarily a fall only scent. Like I could definitely wear this year round. I wouldn't say it's very coffee-y. It's only like a little bit. Like I definitely get whipped cream, um, which could be like the vanilla note on it. Um, I definitely get whipped cream. I get a little bit a little bit of coffee bean and a little bit of like chocolate drizzle. That's kind of what I smell on it. I think it smells really, really good. And I'm very excited to have these. And yeah, so very happy to have these guys and I will, I look forward to using them. So the next couple things, oh, I forgot about this. 
I did get a marshmallow fireside wallflower. I have it plugged in right now and I just paid full price $7.50 for it. Um, but yeah. And then I did get a few decoration items. So I got this little bitty pumpkin and he goes on top of your candles. So um, it has a little magnet on the bottom and it was $3.95. So it's just a little orange pumpkin with a sparkly stem. Very cute. I was like, treat yourself, Victoria. It's your birthday. Just buy what you want. And the last thing I got is this candle sleeve. So this is so gorgeous. Um, it was $16.95, which is cheaper than the other candle sleeves that they have. Um, and it has like a little wooden base and then it has the leaf print on the outside of it and it's gold. It's just really pretty. I don't know if I'm gonna leave in my room or put it downstairs, but I just really wanted a candle sleeve and this was cute. So that is everything that I got from Bath and Body Works. So I had a pretty good little haul. I'm honestly thinking of pulling this out like sooner than Christmas because I just love Vanilla Me Noel. But anyways, let's move on to what I got from Ray Dunn. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna show you is actually something that my mom found at a Home Goods, and no, sorry, at a Marshalls, and it was $19.99, and it's this big giant pumpkin that says Happy Fall, y'all. She sent me a picture of it, and I was like, please get it. It's so cute. And um, I did get like a little baby pumpkin last year, and I think it says Gather on it, or Family. Um, and so I wanted a big giant one. We'll put it by the fireplace. It says happy fall y'all. Just, it's just so cute. So couldn't pass that one up. And then at Home Goods, I found a medium pumpkin that says blessed. So now I have a blessed happy fall y'all. And I can't, I think it's family. I have a little, little bitty baby one that's probably about this big that says family. So we're gonna probably stack these together or like put them in one area together just so they're cute. But it's a ceramic pumpkin and I just thought it was adorable, so had to have it. The next things that I got are candles. So, okay, let me tell you something about Raydun. It is very coveted and you have to get there right when they open and they put everything out to be able to get anything. So that's what I did all weekend. I did that Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. I went to openings of stores, I went around town, and this was all that I found. Those pumpkins, these two candles. So this one I actually found today. It is pumpkin season candle. And it's just white. It's a pretty big one. Um, I think this is the bigger one. They have a smaller one than this. Um, and it's in the scent Pumpkin Latte. And it really does smell like a latte. So um, these are DW Holmes candles actually inside of this. And then the ceramic is from Ray Dunn. So yeah, I just thought it was really cute. Pumpkin season. And then maybe I could put like a little pumpkin in it. See how cute that is? That's really cute. So... I'll probably do that and end up decorating with it. But also, I mean, it smells really good. It smells like a pumpkin latte. It smells like coffee with a little bit of pumpkin spice. So very happy about this one. I kind of mostly got it for the scent, to be quite honest, but it was $12.99 and that's kind of a lot. So I know once I am finished with the scent, I could just clean it out and use it for display purposes only. So very happy about this. And then the next thing that I found, I was like, I was really shocked that I found it. Um, it is this candle, and yes, it's a candle. It has wax on the inside, um, and it's this like sage green color, and it says Autumn Vibes. So she came out with a line for fall this year that has all this green colored stuff, and it was a $14.99. Um, this scent is Peppered Moss. I don't know if I really like it, but I don't dislike it. It's kind of more of those like it almost smells a little bit like grandma, but it really isn't. It's like, it wouldn't give me a headache, but I can still, I can't put my finger on what the scent is. It kind of smells like the Hallmark store. Does that have a smell to anyone but me? Cause that's kind of what it smells like. I don't know. Maybe, no, it smells like Steinmart. It smells like Steinmart. That's what it is. It's like a perfumey smell. So I don't know how to describe that other than that, but I just thought it was really cool that it has this little topper. And you know what? Let me try, let me try this on the other candle. Cause I think they're the same size, right? Let me see. Oh, okay, hold on. Well, it, it almost fits, but it doesn't really fit. And it doesn't really look, it looks really weird on the white candle with the green lid. Um, but I think it's supposed to fit. It's just like these things, they're all hand, well, they're supposed to be handmade. I don't know if they are. And so they have different sizes around it. So I think that's just why it's not fitting, 
but I think it is supposed to fit on other things as well. Um, but this was $14.99 and this one was $12.99 for the same size candle, but I guess you're paying for the lid on this one. I don't know. Still really cute though, and I will find a place to decorate with it. So I'm still happy that I found it. The last thing that I found is actually not either one of those things. It's not Bath and Body Works and it's not Ray Dunn, but I did find it at my local TJ Maxx for $9.99. And it's a Yankee candle. So this is my first Yankee candle I think that I've ever had. Maybe my mom has had them before, but she's not a big candle person. Um, and it is in the scent Vanilla Chai. So I really love chai scents. I've actually never had like a chai anything, chai tea or whatever. So I don't know if I like the taste of it, but I know from Bath & Body Works scents that I like chai. And I have burned this once before. It's a little light, but that's okay by me. Um, I just burn candles in my room, so I don't need them to be like a house filler or anything, but it smells really, really good. I get like a little bit of vanilla. Um, oh, well, it's vanilla chai. Duh. But I get a little bit of vanilla and a little bit of that spice and something smooth in between, like maybe a caramel or like milk. Um, but it's just, it's a very smooth kind of fragrance and I could imagine myself burning this at like any time of year, even if it's not fall or winter. Um, it just feels like a warm drink to me. So and it's a little bit sweet too. I love sweet scents. So this was just my first attempt at trying a Yankee candle. We'll see how it goes. Um, so far I've only lit it once, so I can't be like definitive on if I like them or not, but I figured this would be like my trial run with Yankee Candle, and then maybe if I like this one, then I'll get more if I see them at TJ Maxx or at my local store, which I have one in my mall actually. So I might give them a chance, we'll see, I don't know. I don't really need any more candles, but here we are. I just bought three, so. I'm currently burning a pumpkin donut shop and it smells so good. It smells like powdered sugar donuts. I love it. Um, but anyways, thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed while you were watching, like, comment, and subscribe down below, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.